Hey everyone, Doctor 70 videos here, and welcome back to Super CPS. But not just that, English Super CPS. Yes, because it came back in English, and that no longer means I have to read things in Spanish or you Google Translate or anything like that. So that is all good. Also, this video was almost not going to happen, but um, I realised timings were kind of off, which meant oh, hey 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 ho. Here we go, I can now do another thing you should notice after like so long. And also, I never actually check the news on Super, so I never actually know whenever parties come in. They're like, oh hey, Puff Party's coming tonight. I was like, oh, okay, then it is it. Well, there we go. So this episode always didn't happen, but now it is, so lucky you. So yeah, it's not much to say. It's the Puff Party, Puffles, Huzzah. Even though I don't actually have any puffles, but we're gonna enjoy it anyway, so I'll see you next time. Goodbye. One. You know, something that's really off about this room. Is it the brightly purple dance club? Or brownies, which is a fluffy, spongy texture? Or is it the fact that this entrance is way too small? To be honest, this whole building makes no sense. Two. I'd like to congratulate Super CPPS on remembering the fact that brown puffles are scared of balloons. Showing that Club Penguin forgot every single time. Free. Remember the series Who Killed the DJ? Me neither. Anyway, this is taken very literally in the dance club. You know, there's blooming ghost puffles in a place where a DJ would be. Little Easter egg, I guess. Four. You know how I said about a shark being under the centre circle before? Well, the next strange thing happening at the beach are these greedy puffles. But there's something even odder. This pile never depletes. How? Five. There's a lot going on in this room. First, we have a puffle who's clearly just painting like this. Then we have this puffle. We can make an easel suddenly appear out of nowhere. And finally, we have the puffle sleeping on the job. Who's supporting the sharks for some reason? Logic would tell me yellow puffles would be Fluffy's fans. But you do you, buddy. Six. I I, I just don't know what this world's come to. Let's just move on. Seven. <sighs> now there's not really much to the ski village, so. Uh, Let's just move on to... Oh no! Not more flashbacks! <sighs> Play the clip, I guess. Six. Aww, they made the clown make a 3000 juice duck cloud. Let's make another one. Wait, this isn't a duck. Did Rock have a medal with this machine? Rock Hopper? <laughs> Stupid ongoing gag. Eight. Um, Rim Puffles? I think your cloud kinda fell from the sky. You okay there? Eh, who am I kidding? They're meant to be magical. They'll be fine. But if you're so magic, where's the puffle feeding from, huh? Nine. Okay, I know these balloons have been in a lot of rooms, but I think it's now time to talk about them. Are they supposed to represent orange or gold puffles? I'm just lost. 10. You see everyone, black puffles are the best puffles. Sure they may look grouchy looking, stick their tongues out, but look, they're supportive of all puffles. W wait, 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 wait. How do they draw this with no hands? Their tongues? Ew. 11. Wow, so many balls in this giant ball pit. And then we have this little guy. We sadly didn't quite make it. <sighs> How unfortunate. Twelve. I love how this puffle looks side to side, as if they don't quite know what to do themselves. Oh look, a map. Oh look, a penguin. Oh look, treasure. 13. I really like this gold puffle room. It's in a very suitable spot too. 
There's also this one just chilling. They see me chilling. They hate him. 14. There we go, folks. That's the Puffle Party on Super CPPS. We saw brown, purple, orange, yellow, green, white, rainbow, black, blue, red, and now pink puffles. But screw the rest, especially the puffle creatures. But I don't need any puffles. All I need is my little fly thing. Look, he's wearing a beta hat. 